Hello! I am Mac, at least for a day, and everything's going to be okay. We've just got some big news. There's a new trailer out for the next No Man's Sky update. It's called the Exomech Update. Now, we've had some clues that this was coming for a while. I think it was back after the Synthesis update that we got... Uh, somebody found an image in the files of a mech suit. And I've been saying for a while that I thought some kind of new machine or vehicle or something was coming because there's there's like an extra terminal in the Nexus and there's like a blank spot in space stations now. And b both those things were added in the Beyond update. So I think for a while they've had plans to add some kind of new vehicle or something with upgrades. Uh, but it's taken a while for it to come. And so then in the Synthesis update, that image popped up in the files and someone found it. So we knew that XMX were probably coming. Big uh, mech suit thing that we could ride in. Um, then just a few days ago, there was a leak. A, I want to say German website or some, some website in another country. And this has happened before. Um, that a foreign website accidentally leaked some information about a No Man's Sky update, but um, the, some kind of Steam key trading website um, showed a, a, uh, two images of the mech suit, a couple screenshots, and they looked like you know they'd been made and sent by Hello Games, so we were pretty for sure that they were official screenshots. But it was a leak. It wasn't intended to go out yet because they took the pictures back down. I didn't report on that because although I thought it was probably legit, I decided to just wait until we got a little more news about it. So now we got this trailer. And like I said, the trailer is only on the Xbox YouTube channel. As of the recording of this video, Sean Murray has not tweeted about the update. And the trailer is not on Hello Games's. YouTube channel yet, but I'm guessing it probably will be soon. Uh, when I'm recording this video, I think it's late in the evening or night in the UK, so it could be Xbox went ahead and published the trailer, and then Sean and the rest of the Hello Games gang weren't awake, so they didn't publish anything on their stuff. Um, so I, I think that'll come soon. As soon as Sean Murray wakes up, he'll he'll tweet stuff, or maybe he already has at this point, and I just missed it <laughs> before I started this video. But anyway, about the trailer, a uh, few things I noticed, and I'm sure people are going to point this out, it's a little disappointing, at least in the trailer, there's no evidence of anything else being added besides the Exomex. Um, I'm trying to think, in the Living Ship update, did we even get a trailer for that one? I can't remember if there was a trailer for the living ship. I think... I don't know if there was. Maybe there wasn't. Um, but anyway, in all of the recent updates, Synthesis update and the living ship update, we've gotten more features besides just the one new thing. Like Synthesis update, um, not only did we get the other... the ability to... Um, upgrade our ships, add slots and stuff, but we also got the ability to salvage ships and that actually made it easier to upgrade our sh ships because then we could salvage ships and get nanites um, so that we could in then in turn upgrade our ships more easily. So that added some more gameplay to the game, a whole game loop of salvaging and then upgrading your ships. Uh, and then in the living ship update, not only did we get the new living ships um, that we can fly around in, we also got a whole bunch of new outer space objects um, that we can find while we're pulsing in space. So that added a lot of gameplay too, a lot of exploration we could do out in space. Now in this trailer, like I said, there's not much evidence of anything else besides the Exomech. And I have mentioned this in passing that I think that an, uh, something that adds a mech suit should add com combat gameplay and MZK um, said that as well in a recent video he said that this should be a combat update 
because for one thing we're severely lacking in ground combat in no man's sky it's it's never been great and what other point is there of having a mech suit if it's not for combat or maybe mining um but there was very little indication that there's any new additions to combat in the trailer there's a very brief moment where it shows the player walking in the mech suit towards a sentinel walker with i guess the intention to fight it but i mean that's already achievable we can already sp spawn sentinel walkers so i don't know if they've actually added any new gameplay uh combat systems or what obviously that doesn't mean there definitely isn't any new gameplay mechanics besides the suit but there's just no evidence of that in the trailer um it also briefly shows the mech suit the player in the mech suit mining some crystals but i mean we can do that with our mining lasers um but yeah so a couple things I noticed about the movement of it, it is slow, which is one thing that would kind of make it pointless in comparison to the land vehicles. We've already got four, four land vehicles and a submarine, um, and all of the land vehicles are faster than the mech suit, even, even the tank which is super slow, is faster than the mech suit. So transportation wouldn't really be a reason to use the mech suit. Um, so that's why I'm saying what point is there of it unless it's useful for combat, but we don't need a new big weapon for combat right now because it's not like combat is difficult. Once you get a few upgrades, you can easily deal with all predators and sentinels so, and there's really not a lot of reason to fight the Sentinels unless you just want Pugnium, because fighting the Sentinels just makes more appear, so you're better off running from Sentinels. So the whole Sentinel system discourages you from fighting them. So like I said, we need an update to combat, some kind of new combat system, if we're going to use a big new weapon like the mech suit. Sure, it's cool looking, and one thing that I really like is the interior. The interior looks really cool. I'm definitely excited to try that out in VR, but I'm not trying to be a naysayer here, but at least in the trailer, it's not showing me anything that makes much of a point in using the mech, mech suit. It looks really cool. It looked like it would be kind of fun to get in and try out, but I'm not sure what we would actually do with it which would be useful. We can already mine just fine without it, we can handle combat fine without it. Um, so yeah, <laughs> hoping that we just, there's more to it. Sometimes there is more to it in it than we're shown in trailer. And pretty much always there's more features in the trailer I'm sorry, more features in the update that is not in the trailer. So it is quite possible they've added some new combat systems that will be useful with the mech suit. But there was just no evidence of that in the trailer. So anyway, let me know what you all think. We don't know yet when this update is. Like I said, Sean Murray hasn't said anything about it yet as of before I started this video. And the trailer on the Xbox channel is does not say a release date. It's just a brief trailer. All it really does is show images of in-game gameplay, and it shows the title of the update, which is No Man's Sky Exomech. But it doesn't say when. But, I mean, they always release an update within a few days of a trailer, so I'm pretty sure it will be... See, today's Monday, so it might be tomorrow. Tuesday is a fairly common update day. If not, it'll probably be Thursday. So either Tuesday or Thursday, those days are pretty common update days. Definitely by the weekend, it should be out. So if you're impatient, don't worry. They always do an update right after a creator comes out. So we'll have it within a few days. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm excited, but tell me what you think, what you think the point of having an exosuit is, other than having a cool big thing to ride around in that's really slow and 
can use some weapons. Um, let me know what you think that they might add to make there be a point to using it and stuff like that. I'm sure there'll be upgrades, so getting upgrades for it will be kind of a gameplay mechanic. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can actually use it for something useful. But anyway, let me know in the comments what you think of this new update, and I will see you on the other side of the update. I'll do a first impressions video about it, and I'll probably, uh, probably be doing a new live stream series about the Exomech. I'll, regardless of what we can do with it, I'll find something to do with it. Um, maybe, you know, getting all the upgrades for it or whatever. But anyway, that is it. Exomech update incoming soon. I've been Mac. Thank you for joining me for a day. And remember, everything's going to be okay.